Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be making this yummy jollof spaghetti. But before we get into the video, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed already. Thank you. And to my existing subscribers, thank you for sticking with me. You guys are the best. Let's get cooking. These are the ingredients I'll be using for this jollof spaghetti. First, I'll start by seasoning my chicken. And to season this, I added my chopped onion to my already washed chicken. Added curry powder. Added rosemary, thyme, stock cubes, salt, chicken seasoning. I gave this a good mix and then I let it steam for about 5 minutes without adding water. Five minutes later, I checked back on it and I added about one cup of water and then I cooked for an additional 10 minutes. This is me checking back on the chicken after 10 minutes and the chicken is properly cooked and ready to be fried. To fry the chicken, I heated up vegetable oil and then I introduced the chicken into the hot oil to fry. I fried both sides of the chicken until it was golden brown and looking like this. Then I took it out of the oil. To parboil the spaghetti, I brought a pot of water to a rolling boil and then I introduced the spaghetti into the pot of water. I cooked this until it was soft. This took about 7 to 8 minutes. And immediately I brought it down, I ran cold water over it. Be careful when parboiling the spaghetti because you don't want it to be too soft. For my stew base, I heated up vegetable oil. This is the same oil I use in frying the chicken. And I added chopped onion and I sauteed for about 2 minutes. Next, I added the tomato paste. I fried this while stirring occasionally for about 7 minutes until it became sweet. And then I added the tomato mix and I continued frying. My tomato mix consists of the fresh tomatoes, peppers, onion, ginger and garlic. After about 10 minutes, the stew was properly fried and ready to accept the rest of my ingredients. To season the stew, I used curry powder, rosemary, chicken seasoning and bay leaves. I added grounded crayfish, this is optional. Next, I added the chicken stock and I gave it a mix. I also added water. This is to loosen up the stew. Added salt at this point. And then finally, I added the spaghetti. I used the picker to mix the spaghetti. I also use the wooden spoon to mix the spaghetti. This is just to ensure that none of the ingredients sticks to the sides of the pot. I covered the pot and I cooked until the water in it dried up. And then I added some veggies for garnishing. I garnished with carrots, green beans and green pepper. I cooked for an additional 3 minutes and then I brought it down and that pot of yummy jollof spaghetti is ready. I hope you'll be trying out this recipe. Please do tag me on Instagram and send me pictures. I'd love to see them. Thank you for watching this video and see you in my next one. Bye.